Hey there, welcome back to the channel. Here's the next part in what I got going on for this mission I created. So earlier on I put together my carrier, I added an F-14 flight of four and then an F-18 flight of one. I've now added my waypoints to these guys to send them out to do things. I've also came in here and selected my airports. So this guy here is neutral. This one here is red. This one here is neutral. And I'm having these guys launch from here to attack this one. So basically my objective here is I don't know what's going on, but I'm going to end up over here and, oh, what are these guys doing here? Let's see what's going on. So I have my guys set up for a fighter sweep and they don't know what's going on over here yet. However, what I've done here is similarly to what I did on the carrier deck. So I've came in here, I've zoomed in nice and far, and I've set up a flight of Vigans, some SU-27s, and some MiG-29s. So starting off, we've got Vigan Group 1. I've given them a decent payload to work with. And I gave it a three-man group. And as you can see, let's see, yeah. So when you go to here, take off from parking, you see the number that associates with all these numbers here, 48, 46, 47. So I could move these around if I wanted to, but I just kind of let it auto-populate the three that I wanted to keep them together. And then over here, oh, and these guys have a task of bombing. So when you go to the advanced waypoint thing and you go in here, you could tell it to perform a task, you tell it bombing. And then a little triangle shows up at the end of this uh, waypoint, for lack of a better term, or this line. And basically what I did is I took that line and I shot it all the way over here to this neutral airport and I have them bombing whatever these are some kind of oil tanks or something which I thought was kinda neat and then I also have my MiG-29s set up as a Vigan escort so basically same thing, advanced waypoint actions, escort, edit, perform task, escort. Vigan group, there's only two groups in here. I could choose the SG-27s to escort them as well if I wanted to. And all that does basically is creates that little line with a triangle that basically links them to these guys. pretty sure I got this right because I seen the MiG 29s following them around when I set it up which is good the only thing I thought was weird is my SU 27s here they have a search and then engage protocol so I gave them waypoints as well I'm not sure that I should have given them waypoints if I told them to search and engage because what's happening is they followed the waypoints and then actually no wait a minute did I give them waypoints no they don't even have waypoints they kind of hovered around here and landed so I did something wrong maybe I'll just add a waypoint this time even though I have them searching and engaging over here and this is a neat little thing so basically it creates this giant bubble so if I go to edit search and engage you could change the size of this bubble by this I think it wants to give you like a 10,000 bubble you know which isn't very big at all I pick about 80,000 that seems to be a, a decent radius nice size bubble I'll go here and I'm just gonna add a waypoint all the way over to here And I'll shoot them up to the coast a little bit. 
and then I'll send them back. Maybe they won't, like, land right away, because they didn't seem to search what I told them to search. They just kind of went up, went in a circle around the airport, and started to land, instead of doing my search and engage. So, again, I'm still learning, but this is kind of how you do it. And this is just a quick and easy mission, basically. So, I didn't even set up, like, you can go in here and put together your briefing. You know, red task, blue task. I didn't do any of that yet. I'm still just setting things up and giving myself things to shoot at. But learning as I go. And again, that's kind of how you set up your, you know, red side at an airport, if you will. And you can fill up all these slots. And the nice thing is, the way I have these guys set up, they literally will start moving around and doing their own thing and taking off, which is kind of neat. And I'll detail that in another video, because for some reason my video recording software if I go to check this flight now it quits recording and then I have to start over again so watch for that in another video but anyway thanks for watching I hope this was helpful and uh, if you have any comments or suggestions please let me know until next time